Here's another pricing method that you can use. Instead of charging based on views, which is hard to predict, try to charge based on ROI or return on investment. If a brand's product is selling for say $500 and you charge $500 to do a video for them which promotes their product, then they only have to make one sale to break even. Your engagement rate is a good indicator of how well their offer might convert. And if you have affiliate marketing data, that can also be a good indicator of how well their offer will convert. You also have to know how many views your videos get in that type of category or whenever you review uh, these types of products. So if these videos that you usually make for these types of products usually get say 1000 views and your conversion is 3%, that's 30 sales they can expect. 30 sales of a $500 product is a lot of money. So you have to figure out how much is the brand willing to pay for these types of results. You can go with an ROI based model based on how much revenue you are likely to generate for the brand and then what's appropriate to charge for that potential and what would it take for them to break even. You have to work this into your pitch and communicate it effectively. Lastly, try to position it as them not paying for the content but paying for editing and production work and you consulting them on what would appeal to your audience. If you approach brands from this perspective, you might be able to retain creative control and make sure that everyone is getting value.